Hey everyone, I'm Jake, the Dungeon Master for Venture Ventures, Baldur's Gate Descent into Avernus. Episode 31 will we'll begin in a second here. Let me do a quick, very poor recap of what happened. Essentially, what happened was uh, they got a note to introduce them to Bell, the Archdevil, and started heading out and... Uh, came into contact with some swampy areas and parked and slept near a swampy area leading to some drow assassins approaching the group in the middle of the night asking for help directions stuff like that turns out they were yucklols and uh, a fight ensued one of the yucklols tried to steal their vehicle uh, didn't work out. Uh, Jerry, the barbarian, was taken over, was charmed, and beat the shit out of a wizard for a second. And uh, then they went back to sleep, and they had a second encounter with two more drow. This time they were on to them, and with a good deception, persuasion roll, charisma, charisma roll, uh, the drow left them alone to sleep in their Leoman's tiny hut. And I believe Definitely that's where a we... lie. Full lie. Oh, oh, sure. Yeah. I should just default to <laughs> deception. To be, um, to be fair to Jarvis, I did get banished. <laughs> yeah. It's true. When you bring a wizard within three points of unconsciousness, you get banished. That's, that's Luckily, hey, we have it's... two cat people to touch I... the car. I did not put him to sleep. That's the most important takeaway from all of this. Well, yeah, that wouldn't have worked. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I'm not. I'm not sure what a ninth level no, sleep would be, but I don't even know if it would work on Jerry at this point. Uh, yeah. So you guys are resting, and you wake in the quote unquote morning haven't gotten your full eight hours of sleep it was interrupted multiple times or just once and ollie was uh, the only one that was awake for the second encounter right yes okay i thought i thought you i thought we were like in and almost about to start another initiative the last time we stopped wasn't there like more passers-by i lied to them and and they, they oh right, 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 and right, they right. moved along <laughs> and i didn't wake anybody up so you could all sleep on Nice. They got confused about it, but it was such a good <laughs> lie that they were like, well, well, well okay. I'm, I'm no longer <laughs> at four hit points, so the wizard is happy. Nice. Um, is Jarvis just like totally understanding about getting just smashed with a giant maul? Or is he like, is he just like, oh, it's I understand and he was charmed. I, yeah, I think Jarvis figured out by the time he came back. And I think me and Jerry kind of talked about it at the end of our last session. So Jarvis is... Not mad at Jerry anymore. Yeah, Jerry. Were... Jerry just—he <laughs> said stuff like, "Wow, like it was really interesting to feel like how soft your your body is." <laughs> I felt your. Bones. I didn't. And I didn't. I didn't even have like. I didn't even have like mage armor up. So like, you just went through like butter. Like my AC at the time was thirteen. So it was mall on cloth, <laughs> mall on robe. Yeah. Jerry was very apologetic, though. He's like, "Yeah, I mean, it was like horrible because they're like beating at my bud, but man, <laughs> my squishy, squishy you're, bud. You're, you're like a, you're like a little therapy toy. <laughs> <laughs> they do have those in the Forgotten Realms. I definitely have. sent you to your own Stress therapy reliever. session for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Um, cool. So heading on, let me pull up." the map of Avernus. Don't need that right now. Don't need that right now. All right. Yeah, okay. Uh, so you guys head out and I need the driver to make a survival check or whoever is navigating. Usually. I'll na I'll navigate oh, yeah. for you. Yeah, you do that. 
mod 20. Nice. Uh, you got a couple options. There's a a dock that seems to partially span the river sticks. Uh, looks very well guarded from a distance. Um, or you can try your luck at hopefully finding a uh, ferryman. Yeah, ferryman. A Moreno lot, I believe they're called. Uh, what well, you okay, say like... partially. Yep. Go ahead. <laughs> How partially <laughs> are we talking here? Partially on the bridge it... or the dock. How uh, far? It's like. There are two, f there's, uh, excuse me, one sword like floating ships connected to one of the docks as well. Think of a, a, a dagger blade, just huge, multiple stories tall, uh, cutting through the air uh, on its end. Uh, and that's docked to one of the docks. And make a perception che check to see. Uh, you want to know the distance between and you said well guarded i'd like 17 how well guarded 17 uh it's still a couple hundred feet and then uh you go ahead and make a perception check there ollie what was a couple hundred feet the distance between Eight. across the water or across the river the two docks okay the docks are spanning part of the river already so it's got cutting it. down on uh what do you got eight eight um yeah i mean you see this massive ship and and uh you see things flying around it Perfect. and uh you see um like 12 guards at the tip of one of the docks gotcha. um what's your intelligence mine 10 yeah 10 i think it's fair to say you'd think a ship like that would have would have to be piloted by a good number of whatever's piloting it gotcha gotcha well boy as i uh i don't think we can take all of them down there we might be able to buy a passage on whatever that thing is uh i don't think i was with you guys nope uh, you guys have crossed this river before, right? How'd you do it before? With a ferry, right? Yep. Yeah, okay. we took a we took a, a ferry from this creepy guy and a tall creepy guy in a robe with a I think it very costs long a pole. Soul points. Yeah. Uh, it was like so two, right? How do you how do you get one of those? We you have, have to find them. You have to find them. I have a soul coin. I have two. Sorry. Find the, I have find three, the actually. Man first. Oh, oh. <laughs> it, I mean, I, I guess we should probably try to find a ferryman. I feel like that doesn't give me a good feeling, that, that dagger blade thing. It's real big. A lot of things around it. Everyone here has been pretty much a dick so far, for it the most part. It would be fun to own a ship up here. It would be fun. Uh, five of us cannot pilot that. True. But maybe. I don't if even we... understand how it's supposed to move. Jarvis, see is, it? Jarvis, is there like a spell you got where you can like multiply yourself? Nope. You see the ship. Um, there's a faint uh, reddish. Uh, tail going from the tip in the air down to the river sticks like it's fueling or something gotcha yeah, we, let's go look for a ferry, we could All plant right, one of these we could plant one of these beans and see what happens <laughs> that's always <laughs> a possibility Jarvis, guys, i don't think guys, that's gonna help us i mean last time it gave us a giant pyramid and we could just walk across the the pyramid wasn't that big it was like 200 feet, wasn't it? No, it wasn't. Oh, it wasn't? No, it was like 16. 60 feet 16. tall. Oh. Yeah. It could be used as a ramp. Uh, 
And what are you going to do? Plant the seed in the river? Like, we going Wait. to move the pyramid if we plant it here and move it over there? I was the thinking, like, we, we'd be sneaky, Jarvis sneaky had me at and ramp. we kind of, like, you know, plant it in, like, the edge of the water where there's, like, dirt and water, and then we can get our source of water, and, you know, then we might have a giant ramp. I don't, I don't, I don't think the river better. Styx has water. I don't think that's water. That was like <laughs> some funky water, man. <laughs> glowing i'm pretty sure guys did you miss the part where he said ramp like Ooh, i did how, miss the part that's on my bucket list like Mind remember you, the this pyramid thing is gonna, this, like this, this this thing's huge it's gonna fly like three feet and then then crash into the ground oh, nervous man. heavy this this river is hundreds of feet wide. <laughs> uh, your intelligence enough. No, Jarvis is just messing, like strictly oh, okay. messing at this okay. point. Like Jarvis knows that it's not going to work. Jarvis just really wants to play with the beans. <laughs> so looking for Fair any enough. opportunity possible. Jarvis also knows it's very possible that it's not a pyramid that comes out of it. <laughs> so beans? No beans. Mm. Not today. I could plant a bean. Let me just drive away if it doesn't go our way. Yeah. <laughs> What's the worst that could happen, guys? We Maybe they'll give us a boat. <laughs> Maybe That's we'll get a boat. Worst, Maybe but... something comes out of the bean that just attacks everyone, and we just watch and laugh. Oh, we're gonna. I feel like if we there. do it from a safe distance, like I can, I'll throw it really no, far. It needs water. You can't do that. You gotta tend to it. You gotta sing to it. You actually. gotta. You gotta. But I can. Throw it and then throw the water on top of it. <laughs> we need to make Jerry a water I'll, balloon. I'll play the flute. It'll make it grow better. How far away are we away from this this dock right now? Mile. Uh, Does it look like we can get sneak up without anyone seeing us to get maybe within thirty feet make of it? Make a perception check. Thirty feet. Oh, getting right yeah. up there. Okay. It's a bold move, huh? Thirteen. Uh, yeah, you you uh, it it looks pretty packed and well guarded. Hmm. We could just go try to fight a ferryman. I mean, I mean, really. we could just ask these guys. I mean, they might just take us take us across for, or they might kill us all. Can we, we, can we yell at them from right. the car? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Nobody gets out. <laughs> sort of deal. <laughs> Like, just kind of slow down a little bit. There <laughs> are uh, infernal machines at the base of these docks as well. Gotcha. <laughs> We're just gonna go down there and cat call at them. Like we could. Can you can you take us across? <laughs> <laughs> Free of charge. Or I could just look for a ferryman. I haven't done it before. Are they hard to find? We got super easy last time. All right. Let's look for a ferryman. I'll start driving up the river, and I start driving up the river. I feel like there's a song about driving up the river, Can, but before, it's not. Before we go, definitely a banjo. <laughs> before we go, does anyone are they all wearing the same type of uniform? No, some of it's some of them are not wearing a uniform. Some of them are just wearing chains. Some of what them are. are them? Does it look like we like? I think three of us can cast this guy self, right? One person has a hat, and I think me and Rollercoaster can, right? I have the hat and the spell. I can like do a really good impression of one of my brothers. So I'm like what if charming. what if we what if we took this in a different route and you know Ollie you're you're a very convincing person. What if the three uh, the three of us uh ch changed ourselves to look like guards and we brought Jerry with us as a prisoner and maybe convinced them to let us cross uh oh. to the other side. Oh my god, Jarvis, you just blew my mind. That is so smart. <laughs> I, mean, oh, I can't disguise myself. That is myself. such a good idea. We have to do it now. You, 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 could, have, you could have the you hat. You have this hat. And I'll give Ollie hat. the hat of disguise self. Ooh, I can. I still got this ring. Or hat of disguise. No, Ugh, the ring just makes is, you look pretty. Hat is so much uglier than mine. I'm removing it from my inventory. So. Add it to yours. But it has so many more features. I reluctantly take off my by cockpit. you can make it look on. just like this it. this hat, hat is disguised and that is the first thing that i do <laughs> <laughs> once i have attuned to it i will so make it are... look like a by cockpit. 
So you guys are doing this plan? Yes. Does it look like we'll be able to take the <laughs> infernal machine over the bridge? <laughs> no, we're going to uh, ask them to well, take us over the bridge. It, yeah, it doesn't does it, look like you're going to be like able to... Like, there's a couple hundred feet gap between, at least, between the two docks. Is there another infernal machine on the other side? Not with your perception check. You didn't see any. We also have Lulu. True? What does that mean? I'm just Lulu through all those things. It just doesn't seem like a good idea to me. It doesn't. That's a good point. Mm, I forgot about Lulu. (laughs) Mm. I mean, guys, everything hates me down here, so. I don't hate you, Lulu. I guess we could have two prisoners. There are three of us. Yeah. She's going to draw a lot of attention. If she um, sees us. All the more heaven reason. Dumbo. Right. Just, she's our prisoner. So if we say that. Just, and, uh, put a, just cover with. Class, but how, are, right? how are we getting across, though? We're going to get on that thing. And it's going to go. So- me. Just, just so we're clear, uh, as I said earlier, there's, there's at least uh, a dozen creatures of some sort, right. some that you recognize as bearded devils, uh, right. horn devils. <laughs> just so we're clear, this is Jake saying, "Get the fuck out!" Of here. I will TPK your ass if you do something so stupid, and I won't feel bad about it at all. Roll up new fucking characters. I'm not saying you'll TPK. You could trick them. I don't know what the dice do. Oh, or you can fucking run. Or or, I can, or or we can save two soul four soul coins. Uh, or two. I, listen, I already put my vote in for the ferryman. So. Oh man, I only want to do it if it's unanimous. So, yeah, it's, I'm a I'm a flip is... a coin, <laughs> so to speak. I don't know. I, the dice I say do like it. The most the direct way. Yes. <laughs> what could go wrong? <laughs> so we're two, two, the guy, two Lulu. What the guy who's lost two characters flips a coin. So should we? Uh, <laughs> I can use I can use uh, well, I could use minor illusion to put some type of handcuffs on one of them. Um, I could do the other one. Yeah. <clears throat> Okay. Actually, I think. Do we have evolved minor illusion cantrips? I think our can. I think our illusions are even better, somehow. Because of evolving cantrips. Oh yeah. How does I need to look that up? I keep forgetting about that. Look. How many times can I download it? Is the question. What's an evolved? Can you send me the? You said you. There's a PDF for that, right? It's pinned in pinned reference materials. Minor illusion. At fifth level, you may create up to two images of objects and sounds that all must fit in a five-foot cube. I will minor illusion up Lulu some impressive cuffs that chain her uh, trunk and feet and tusks. They, like chains them all together um, in an evil dark iron. Hit me with uh, read that again for me. I was um, all my hundred percent of my brain power is going towards spelling. Oh no problem. Minor illusion just says you can create two images with your minor illusion within the five foot cube. I'm still creating right on. one image, so it doesn't really apply here. Is <laughs> is it going towards spelling or thinking about how you're going to TPK us right now? Like let's no, I, I don't even <laughs> think about that. The game well, does that for me. All right. Uh, so, okay. So just so we're in little... agreement, boys. Shit goes down. We run. Yes. Get back to the car. We run or we fly. I'm you fly because you're slow as fuck. The rest of us will run. <laughs> you yeah. can take Jerry with you even better, or Lulu because she might. She can fly. She can also fly. I don't know how fast she is. I mean, Jerry's pretty I mean, fast too. I mean, guys, just a heads up. It looks like they can fly too. Because there's several of them flying around. Just <laughs> we gotta book it fast. I know me and you are real fast on land. Well, we just got to get to the car. <laughs> For a and short we, burst, I can we go drive fast away <laughs> as fast as we can. <laughs> as they uh, fly uh, after us and drive after us with multiple vehicles. <laughs> uh, Jarvis, if you could shackle Jerry, please. Yep, and I, uh, I make the chains look like just like the ones that I saw when I was in the mansion that we're moving mm-hmm. around, and I put it around his feet and hands, but to the point where he still can walk. You can animate 
Well, not not animating, but the same looking chain. Sorry. Okay. Not animated. Uh, from the mansion, they were very much animated. Just reminding you. Um. Actually, can I? Let me see if I can animate them. Actually, the way it's written, because that would be. I would really like to, cool. guys. I think one of the keys to the success of this plan is a good name, and I want to name this operation Operation oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Rivers Six. <laughs> Like it. It's good. Real, real quick, what are we doing with Jerry's weapon? We obviously can't leave him armed. Don't we have that bag uh, you can shove things into? I can put it in my bag of holding. I just want to know if that's what we want to do. Uh, yeah, before we do that, do. aren't I'll, you at uh, max? You're at max cap on that, aren't you? My bag of holding, though. No. Oh, okay. That was a different game. I'll, Never mind. It's got a one foot diameter hole opening. I'll hold Jerry's uh, hammer. And uh, that way I can give it to him if I need to. Because I don't want that thing to be far away from him. Yeah. Not me neither. And I'm also carrying a great axe. <laughs> I can go in the bag. Okay. Will it fit? <laughs> uh, I'm just going to do matching chains to look like what Ollie did. Because I don't think I can do that <laughs> moving effect. No, it won't fit. The head, I mean, the handle obviously will. Wait, but wait, the... wait. We can leave that one just here at the car. No, if I do. No, we're taking the car. Oh, no, never no, mind. I mean, we just yeah, leave it on, on the like floor in the car. Yeah, let's do that. Is it a magic grade X, Jerry? No. Are you going to need that on the other side? We're taking the car with us. Oh. Is that going to fit? It's going to fit on the ship? Now. Oh, wait, Jerry, get in the hook. Oh, okay, cool. Like he's grappled? That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, act like you're beat up because that thing's not hard to get out of. So they're going to be suspicious. <laughs> that unicorn did Play not dead. have any trouble. <laughs> Play dead. Okay, so Jerry's oh, yeah. not... I'm not using minor illusion on Jerry then. Uh, leave the shackles on. Couldn't hurt. Okay. For... For this, so the one minute cast on Minor Illusion, I can keep recasting it right before the one minute's up to keep it going without it disappearing, right? Okay, yeah. You, you can do that. Okay, cool. Same. <clears throat> um, and my focus is my sword, so, so I have my sword out while I'm doing all of this. <laughs> but yeah, let's, uh, let's go, let's go make some friends. Okay. All right. <laughs> uh, <laughs> guys, disguise self doesn't let us change our body type. Like we can appear like taller, fatter, thinner, and we can look like different human beings. Or different you just can't be a different size. But we're, well, we can't change ourselves into devils. You? you can, you can. Um, what do you mean? Like, what are you reading about it that? I mean, it says you uh, you can change your oh wait you can't change your body type is specifically what it says. Body type refers to, I believe, the size. St like sta Oh, is that what it is? It also as long as you have the same arrangement, there are devils that have the same arrangement of. Okay. Just no tail. You can't have a tail or something. Yeah, you, you can't like. I have a have tail. a second head. <laughs> well, uh, you could be a spine devil then. You could yeah, you could be a spine devil or something. Okay. You can't I be like. Yeah. I'm going to look like a demon. Mm -hmm. What kind of demon? Uh, something in the vein of Grazd. So something dark, humanoid, and uh, stunningly beautiful. Just very like good looking. Vlad. <laughs> okay. Uh... You mean he's? I think he's a devil, <laughs> isn't he? He's a demon lord. Oh, you're you're on it now. No more I... confusion for Brian. I read about it. <laughs> he studied. <laughs> I got, got tired take. of fucking it up. I figured it out. <laughs> I, I do the same type of shit when I'm like, <laughs> it's such a simple concept and I can't get it right. I'll just I be like, finally figured studying it out. this. Like you yeah. said, I read the lore and that straightened it all out. And it's like, oh, now, now that there's stories behind it, I can keep it a little right. better. I can yeah. get it straight. All right. So yeah, uh, I change into a demon and then I turn to you guys and go, uh... I know demons and devils don't get along, but run with it here. Look like me. Or something like uh, this. <clears throat> sure. Yeah. I make myself... A, Here's the problem. A, a I can't different... speak like demons or devils, but I can speak like a demon. 
Mm. I can speak infernal. You want to take point on this? We Not really. Like devils. I mean, <laughs> we have a much the least better enthusiastic chance person. with you on point. <laughs> yeah. Let's be de- demons. Okay. Demons it demons is. Demons it is. Okay. And I make myself appear somewhat like him. Okay, so so you're going to drive on your... Yes. I do one more thing. Yep. I find a scrap of white cloth somewhere amongst our clothing or person. Um, I smear it with blood. And then I... Blood fly of who? Th- uh, Some of Jarvis's blood off of my mall. <laughs> it's dry. <laughs> Damn. Um, then it's my get, you can get some oh, red on wet it. Blood? Okay. You want wet blood? <clears throat> yep. Then, okay, then so, my own. So you're gonna cut yourself. I'm gonna cut myself. The back of my hand, not the palm of my hand, like an idiot. <laughs> um, <laughs> roll a d4 for me. Sure. Oh man, four. <laughs> yeah, you hit a you hit a vein and shit. Too much. No, nope, this is good. This is what I wanted. All I'm right. also gonna proactively <laughs> catch ma- cast mage armor. Nice. And also, <laughs> looks like M- Minor Illusion is not a concentration spell, so I can still cast other spells during this. Mm-hmm. So Until we enter initiative order, <laughs> then it matters. Okay, um, so you guys are driving up. How close are you going to drive up to... Bloody white flag. Okay. I'm going to drive up... <clears throat> 100 feet. So, wait, wait, wait. No, so I'm is Lulu drive up in the grappling hook with me? Feet away. No, she's just manacled. You're a lot okay. bigger than you're, you're scarier than <laughs> um, I'm gonna drive up a hundred feet away. I'm going to um, press to digitate uh, a shower of sparks to draw attention and then I'm gonna shout as loudly as I can prisoner exchange in abyssal. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> All right. Uh, how close did you say? I'm sorry. Were you going to just within shouting distance? Within shouting distance. Okay. I'm thinking like 150 feet. I should be able to shout pretty loud. Let's see how far 150 <laughs> feet is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. It's been an impressive tape measure. <laughs> um,. Okay. Like half a football field, right? Yeah. 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 Sure. Uh, all right. So you guys drive up. As you're getting then, closer, you... yeah, and, and then I slowly start driving up as long as they don't start attacking us. Okay. Uh, as you drive up, uh, remind me what you yell again. I'm checking a bunch of shit right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> sure, I get it. Prisoner exchange is what I yell in abyssal. Uh, make a deception check. All right, get your tail. 25. Okay. Was that high enough? <laughs> That's just the first roll, man. Now that you're... Yeah. <laughs> uh, now that you're closer, uh, just at the base of this dock, you see two... almost looks like construct type creatures uh clad in thick armor they have almost like baby faces large baby faces that are sunk down into their armor kind of in their chest region and then you see uh two more bone devils and you see two familiar not familiar as in you've you've met these particular individuals uh you see uh two of the type of devil that you fought on the road out of Baldur's Gate. Uh, and you also see a, a a fiendish character in robes and a jackal head has a book uh, and an eyepiece. And um, the two bone devils are behind uh, some weird, gnarly, heavy metal looking uh just uh what's the word i'm looking for uh earth no phalanx uh, not um phallic phalanxes no uh yeah, phalanx. phallic? 
Uh, is that a thing? Yeah. Phalanx uh, is the word. Or phalanx? like a ballista. Oh, okay, yeah, ballista. There you go. A phalanx is like a Roman a phallic ballista. formation. It. Yeah, it wasn't phalanx. I just stopped in the middle of phal. <laughs> the- no, phallic ballista. We yeah. got it. <laughs> um, Cannon. <laughs> uh, sure, it's hell. So what is that? Uh, they got weird shit. Ballista, uh, like uh, art, uh, artillery-sized crossbows? Yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah. Um, and uh, to kill dragons. Yeah, there you go. It's also good at punching through doors and buildings um, and people. Really good at that. Exceptional. The uh, the jackal-headed figure. Um, and you notice that the uh, cambians that are flying are kind of paying attention to the jackal-headed creature and the bone devils. You just see their heads, and they're also keeping an eye on you, but also listening to the jackal-headed figure. And... Yeah, that was... What was yours again? A 25 deception? Yeah. Okay. Uh, All right. Um, The jackal-headed figure in abyssal uh says to you uh approach by approach you Would drive you closer yes okay uh how, how close how much closer i get like 20 feet away from him do you guys disembark no not yet <laughs> and the uh, jackal says what prisoners there's a bounty out on the big one and bell would like the that that shiny one right there uh the are the um jackaletted figure is trying to look around because this thing is shaped in a way that it's very hard to see the back of the claw and uh, is that a holophant I don't know what it's called, but it reeks of the upper heavens. I would need to examine the prisoners closer to make sure they're not dead. I think you can examine them just far enough like you are. Hey, shake, (laughs) shake the shiny one. I'll just yell to so, whoever's near Lulu to shake Lulu. <laughs> shake Lulu. Lulu, make a noise. Lulu, Lulu goes, Whoa. and uh, I. You have a holophant in manacles, just her feet, a holophant, and the trunk <laughs> and the tusks. <laughs> Well, it doesn't look like the tusks are tied down right now. No, they are. <laughs> and what are you wanting in exchange for these prisoners? Oh, no, we're not exchanging with you. We need to get them to Bell. We need to get across the river. Approach the ramp, please. This is the fiend we're talking to. You're talking to the jackal-headed, uh, the jackal-headed creature. I have your assurance that we'll be crossed safely. As soon, yes, as soon as I can verify that the one on back isn't dead, and this one I can get a closer look at. I just I drive the car so it turns a bit. I don't really get that much closer, but just so we can see the back of it. Um, and I like whip the car real quick so that the chain swings okay. and prompting Jerry to uh, hopefully grunt or make a noise or move his body in some way. <laughs> okay. Uh... <laughs> so he's alive too. Well, uh, he looks in his book and starts flipping through pages. 
uh, looking through his monocle and uh, says, well, I'll leave it to Bell to sort this out. Rightfully so. That's the plan. Do not interact with any of the other denizens of the docks. Don't plan on it. Most people here are dicks. Just right up there. Yes. Okay. I drive on. All right. Uh, Don't we have like essentially a note that says we can go see Bell? Yes, but that's the letter of introduction for Bell. Oh, okay. Can't uh, show that to other people and be like, I'm going to see Bell. Maybe. As Many you tools in our pockets. Yeah. As you do that. Um, let's roll initiative. Because the two ballistas turn towards you and the two cambians uh, fly behind you. And that's where we're going to start. Okay. No insight checks from anyone on this jackal-headed figure. I was focusing on the conversation too much. I get it. I, get it. I also was like, I was going to do, I was going to use my uh, helm to the one in conversation, and then I totally forgot to do it once we started talking. <laughs> Jarvis, what'd you get on initiative? 19. Okay. Jerry? 10. Don't you get advantage on those? Yeah, it's just, it keeps happening to me. I, I roll twice insane. and I get... Yeah. I only have plus one initiative, so... Roll close, you're muted. 24. 24. Not 20. 15 for me. Okay. <laughs> Fucking Lulu. All right. Oh, I forgot to mention as well, the Marigons are uh, in front of you that I described earlier with the baby faces. <laughs> right, 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 so there's right, a total right, of right. two, four, six, seven, eight, ten characters right around us. Uh, including you? Well, no. The the we have the two cambians. Two we have cambians. the bone de two bone devils. We have the two from the like similar to the ones we fought in Boulder's Gate, and then we have the guy in robes and the jack jackal headed creature all around us, right? And then the two ones you just mentioned. Uh, the the Cambion is the ones you fought in the ones. Oh, that like okay, the cool. Yeah, and the jackal headed guy and the robe guy are the same guy. Oh, okay, cool. I was adding extra people that didn't exist. Not a problem. All right. Rollercoast. I'm going to first hunter's mark one of the Cambions. Okay. And then my two attacks and my dread ambusher, all sharpshooter. At, that, At that same Cambion, yeah. Yeah. It's a 12. That does not hit. It's a 15. That does not hit. It's a nat 20. That does hit. That's the good one to get a nat 20 on. Is that... Okay. Not when you roll a bunch of ones. Double that to 30 plus 10, 40. Five damage. Damn, 45. Nice. And that is all for me. It's now the ballista's turn. What did uh, roll? I had to walk away real quick. What did Rollercoast just hit? Like one of the Cambians flying. Okay. One of the Cambians flying. All right, pulling up some other stance. So, if Rollercoast was who was on the who was on the thing controlling Jerry? The claw. I don't one know. Of you too. 
Okay, then I'll assume that I was on it if Rollercoaster had. Um... He's not on any station. He's shooting uh, his. I can just shoot my bow. Okay. Don't need no station. The capacity for the machine is eight creatures, but there's only four stations. Got it. Okay, then that I assume that I'm on Jerry Station then. Yeah. Cool. All right. Uh, okay, so that is plus. That. And then I'm also going to yell punch it after I shoot my arrow. All right. You are facing the wrong uh, way. The wrong way. <laughs> the wrong way for escape. Yeah. Uh, the two bone devils and their ballistas do uh, a 24 and a 21. Both hit. And... It's gonna be that. I'm just gonna use my quicker to not fuck around with dice. Uh, as two harpoons with infernal iron chains behind them shoot at your vehicle, uh, oh, no. attached to the ballistas. Um, that are not mobile. They're stuck in the ground like turrets. Right. Um, they each do 24 points. What's the 20, 20. Uh, and they lodge themselves in your vehicle. That's a problem. Guys, this might have been a bad idea. <laughs> and it's now the Maragon's turn. I'm not gonna lie, my oh, friend my friend messaged me right after we decided to do this saying this is such a bad idea. <laughs> what D D's for. Uh, we need mishaps for both of those though. Oh, mishaps? Mishaps is twenty. Damage threshold is only ten. Oh, okay. I was thinking of Sorry. the Yeah. I should have let you finish your question. Um, all right. Okay, you got one of them is an engine flare as the engine uh, emits a large gout of fire engulfing the vehicle. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and then the other one is a uh, lock steering. Uh, re like. Uh, yeah, okay. So let me just read that real quick. Cool! <laughs> so the only direction <laughs> we could go is forward. Uh, only if we stay in the car, and frankly, I don't think we can go forward anymore either. <laughs> well, it's a good thing you guys are cats. Yes. <laughs> yes, it is. You don't have to be faster than the enemy. So be faster than the people you're with. <laughs> hey, I'm about to dimension door to me. That's dimension door out of this place. <laughs> How many times can you dimension door? Uh, twice. Nice. Hopefully that's enough. All right. Um, the Maragon uh, has heavy crossbows and. One of them is going to shoot at the driver who has half cover or what? How much cover do you, does it say? Three quarters. Three quarters. Okay. Uh, does a 21 hit? Not with three quarters cover. Nice. And I took my shield AC off since I'm driving. I wouldn't be shielding. But it still doesn't hit. And it's going to run up to the vehicle and hop on. Jump into the flames. Oh, it probably doesn't care. <laughs> oh, yeah, right. It doesn't We're, seem to, doesn't seem to care. <laughs> doesn't seem to care. 
<laughs> um, Jarvis, at the beginning of your turn, you take 11 points of fire damage from the uh, engine explosion. Of course I do. That's nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not that hurt. Um, can I, in one round, like, knock, tr just try to, like, knock the controls that's holding Jerry open without using an action, maybe a bonus action to knock it out, and then use my action to um, Dimension Door? I got good news for you. Huh? It's a bonus action to release the grapple. Yes! Oh, it says on the... It nice. Says on the thing. Stat blocks. All right. So bonus Thanks, option. Blocks. Bonus right? action. Release <laughs> grapple. Uh, to okay. to to free Jerry, and I'm going to use my distance to get close enough to him to touch him, and um. Okay. Make a uh a uh, acrobatics check. Okay. Jumping off. A nineteen. Eighteen. Sorry. Yeah, cool. You're good. Um, and then I'm gonna dimension door, and I'm can go two hundred feet. I want to go 200 feet away from these guys. Is there anything that I can dimension door be open up a door behind so that they can't see me come out of it? As you cast a spell, the jackal headed creature waves back and uh, counter spells me. Someone that knows how to use counter spell. <laughs> oh, rude. <shit>. Burn. Rude. <laughs> rude. <laughs> um, so harsh. <laughs> Rude. What level did you? Is that? It's a fourth level. Okay. Well, I believe it. If they're at equal. Oh no! I'll still roll. Yeah, we're good. Uh, your spell fizzles out, but you're next to Jerry. The the doorknob on the dimension door is this like locked? You reach like to rattling. grab it and it goes. <laughs> <laughs> goes nowhere. Disappears. Shit. Okay. Um, I'm going to jump back on the vehicle. Oh, it's on fire right now, isn't it? Oh, bloody hell. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um I'm just going to stand. I'm just for the now just going to stand behind Jerry and I'm out of action. So I'm just going to kind of hide behind Jerry. And Brian, uh, Ollie has his mall. Or he yes, has his mall. Yeah, okay. Keep that in mind there, Jerry. You don't have your mall. I got plans for it. It's all part of what I was... I'm good. <laughs> okay. We're good. Uh, can I use... The... It, can I use my... Can I... It's only actions you can do... You can hold on to. Like, I can't hold on to movement, right? Until something happens? No, I don't think so. Okay. Uh... It's the other Maragon's turn, and it is going to shoot its crossbow again at the driver. Right, oh. right, right. Net 20 obviously hits. Eighteen piercing damage from the heavy crossbow yep. and it too jumps on the vehicle runs up and jumps on the vehicle it's very disconcerting to have these massive uh or they're medium but they're large medium creatures metal constructs uh with baby metal baby heads uh, <laughs> looking at you very very disconcerting they were designed to be very like relaxing with the baby faces <laughs> sure sure <laughs> had the opposite effect so was chucky uh <laughs> ollie it's your turn okay um i'm going to try to run away jump off the thing you take 11 fire damage as you yeah. uh yeah any yeah, of your right, turn right do that Okay. I'm, I'm trying to run. Um, I'd like to. Uh, you hop off the vehicle, make a quick yeah. acrobatics. Just we'll see if yep, you. Yep, yep. All good. Uh, great. Cool. <laughs> to a twenty-one. Cool, cool, cool. Um, I want to haphazardly throw the mall towards the back of the vehicle. Um, I'm not. What? I'm not in the back. Oh, per okay. se. Um, you're not what? I'm not in the vehicle. Per se. Yeah, no, you're just near the. You're back saying of behind it, it yeah. yeah. Yeah, just I'm I'm throwing it in that direction. Yeah, you're, you're like you hop off and you, 
Yeah, exactly. I just want to. I'm just driving the point home that I'm not aiming this. I'm just trying to get it in 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 that direction because my focus is running the fuck away. So I have V-lines grace and uh, action dash. Make a strength check on sure. your. See, <laughs> my strength is there. I got a zero. <laughs> <laughs> so, Holy uh, shit. You have it, and you, uh, as you're swinging it, heave ho, uh, it, nothing's in your hand, and the mall falls and hits the ground at the front of the vehicle. Um, well, I'm not stopping. Uh, <laughs> convince me why that wouldn't be an action. Because I'm not paying any attention to it. I'm just. <laughs> but the throwing of the mall, way. you don't think that's an action? I was hoping bonus action because I'm not trying, I'm not aiming it. I'm not trying to hit anything. I'm just, I'm just offloading it akin to dropping a weapon. Roll a D4 for me. Okay. And let's see. Uh, we'll let sure, fortune sure. figure I'm, it out. You know, I'm on board with that. Yeah. Three. Yeah. Uh, it's an action. Um, Damn. Then I don't dash, but I sure as hell run. Felines. Yeah. <laughs> so 30 feet. 60 feet. Uh, 60 uh 60 feet with feline's grace is that correct yeah Yeah. okay and that recharges even without dash 60 feet for you guys when does that recharge uh when i take a turn and don't move oh okay so okay when i spend what you can't use it again until you move zero feet on one of your turns cool it's the only ability like that that i can all right so i'm 60 feet away hurting Mm -hmm. (laughs) Where is my great axe? Hurting. My pride, my skin. <laughs> Where's your great axe? Near the front it's of the vehicle. It's in the front of the vehicle. Yeah. Oh, one's, in the, one's in the front in the vehicle. One's in front of the vehicle. <laughs> Man. That sucks. This went the wrong direction, guys. That's okay. You could take a few hits, Jerry. You got it. Not from 10 characters. <laughs> Well, them are still shooting at me. Mm-hmm. You're fine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Sorry, guys. Give me a second. <sighs> Oh, you mean you didn't an- anticipate good. us creating havoc? <laughs> no, it's just I got a. No, I'm joking. I, 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 yeah. And this is. It's going to chain lightning. Ah. <laughs> uh. Okay. Uh, oh, wait. I might be far enough away. I don't, know, what that, real I don't know that spell well enough. <laughs> Let's find out who dies. Okay. All right. Uh, I need... Rollercoaster, did you feline's grace too? No, I shot at things. Right, you're still in the vehicle. Yep. The vehicle was still operational. Yeah, no, I was the first up. Everything was great when it was my turn. <laughs> okay. I need uh... Rollercoast, Jerry, and Jarvis to make dexterity saving throws. Oof. Not 20. 11. So 26. Oh, <laughs> two. Okay. Uh, boop, boop, boop. All right, Jarvis, uh, you failed with an eleven. Mm-hmm. Jerry you failed with a two. You take forty-six. Ugh. I have it yeah. one hit point. Lightning damage as the bolts <laughs> jump from roller coast forty-two through the vehicle. 46. 46. 23. Uh, from roller coast, uh through the vehicle to you guys in an arc of lightning. 
And you take half of that there, Rolikos. Who has that? The jackal-headed one. Okay. That's what I thought. Just making sure. Jackal-headed one. All right. Jerry. I run 80 feet. I dash eighty feet and you're you're leaving your mall. Yeah, leave okay. my mall. Yeah, okay. Just making sure. Doesn't seem I... like any shot of <laughs> doing anything else in this one. Okay, eighty feet, and well, Jarvis is fucked. <laughs> I was thinking about like picking you up, but I, I don't. I don't know if I could do that and still be a, still be able to dash, or that would be your action to pick me you up. You can probably. still dash, um, but you move at half speed if you're carrying someone else. That wouldn't, yeah. So it. Uh, I don't know. I figured you would fly away. So no, the first I cam, Cambian, uh, flying above you guys. Um, Just want to have an there. arrow sticking out of it. Yeah, this one has a arrow uh, sticking out of, through it. Through it, actually, it's still embedded, but it's good shot. Uh, shoots a fire ray at at uh, Ollie. Whoa! Probably doesn't hit though. Uh, does an eighteen hit, sir? No, sir. Okay, it's going to shoot another fire ray at you. Hmm. 23 hit. Yeah. Okay. Holy shit. 17 fire damage. Okay. And that's his turn. The next Cambion... <clears throat> is going to try and charm uh, Jerry. So I need you to make a wisdom saving throw, Jerry. From 80 feet away? He's flying. He's already behind the vehicle. And uh, he can get within range. It's not hard to charm Jerry. Uh, what you, wisdom saving? Yeah. Ooh, 20 mod. Nice, nice. Uh, you feel a certain affection for one of the flying red I devils. feel super then, smart. I blacked out. And, <laughs> and then you're like, no, this guy's an asshole. Fuck this guy. Uh, all right. Lulu's turn. Uh, poor Lulu. Lulu's going to fly out of the car and get as far as she can. Relicos, you take 11 fire damage as your turn starts. I jump out and book it. Uh, Feline's Grace and Dash to get me 120 feet away. Okay. Bone well, Devils. me on that run. Hell yeah, yeah. I did. Alright. Bone Devils turn. Oh, that's not a uh, once. Oh, that is concentration. Never mind. Right. Bone devils are going to get out of their station and uh, fly dash as well. And they get 
right close to you, uh, a little past you there, Ollie. All right. Maragons. What do the Maragons want to do? Maragon's going to get off the vehicle, run to the side of it, and or run to the back of it, and attack Jarvis. Of course it is. With two... Uh, uh, no, okay, yeah, it's still two. Um, two halberd attacks. I got a 15 on the first one and a 17 on the... The 15 misses, and I use my shield as a reaction on the second one. Nice. To buff my AC and cling misses. Nice. All right. Jarvis, it's your turn. Uh, Jerry's now gone, so I'm in a dimension door by myself and try this again. Okay. Try to hide something in 200 feet where I can hide behind something. Where I can open up he's, my door and no one will see. I'm just going to counterspell it again. Ugh! This fucking asshole. Fizzles out. And he went already, so he had that reaction back, didn't he? Yeah. Damn it. Well, Jarvis is rolling a new character. <laughs> Jarvis is not, maybe. Well, Gary, Gary's <laughs> rolling a new character. The other Maragon is going to do the same as his pal. You now have two creepy baby faced metal baby faced fiends. I had to look up what that looks like. I'm like, oh, yeah, those are kind of fiendish. And uh, two more halberd attacks. They, they look very Roman in the depictions online. One's a nat 20 and the other's a f- uh, four plus. It's not going to hit. Twelve slashing damage from the halberd. Jarvis. Uh what was it to hit? Sorry. Uh Nat 20. Oh on yeah. The, yeah. I'm I'm unconscious. Okay. Ugh. Ollie, what do you want to do? Oh crap, it already came to me. I am going to I'm going to fourth level cure wounds myself. Okay. Third, third level cure wounds myself. Sorry. Did uh, Did you remember Lulu? Yeah, she ran. Okay. At the end of the, she can't run very far, but she's just doing her, or fly very far. She's doing her best. Okay, so 3D. That's, that's, so that's my action. 15, 19. 23 points healed. Um, and then I will run 30 feet. Scratch that. I'm going to uh, take a runner's stance and not move at all. What does that mean? Down, get down on my gra- on the ground, you know, hands down, like I'm about to, like I'm a, like I'm a. Okay. Yeah, you're, a you're charging. Your... I'm charging, charging up my felines, Chris. <laughs> Um, and I don't think I have a, oh, let me check one thing. Action, bonus action. Potion of healing. Drink that too. Okay. Bonus action. Drink that. That's my turn. Two, four, six, six more points from that. Right. (sighs) 
the arcana loth uh waves his paws in the air and a loud sound echoes from the docks a warning type of sound like a very low horn and the arcana loth is Is going to Dimension Door. Hmm. Must be nice Way to actually out. be able to successfully Dimension Door. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You don't have your reaction. Nope. I'm unconscious. Also, that. Uh, <laughs> like your hand movements there, Brian. <laughs> I just watched a Seinfeld episode where they're he's trying to read lips because Jerry's dating someone who's deaf, and uh, there's a lot of hand signals like that. Uh, so that's what it reminded me of. Uh, all right, and um, Jerry, it's your turn. Um. So, where did the guy end up when he died? When he uh, dimension doored? Way out ahead of the direction you're running. So I see him, or is he yeah, too far in front of you? It's pretty, pretty small though, like more than a hundred feet ahead of you. Oof, man. Uh, and where are uh, Ollie and Rollercos in relation to me? Uh. I ran 80 feet last turn. I'm not yeah, so you're pretty that... close to Ollie, and Rolikos is just ahead of you. Like, how far ahead? 80 feet. Or 20 feet. Or, sorry, 40. 40 feet. feet. 40 feet away from him. Oh, okay. So I'll just, I'll run to where Rolikos is and get my shield out and make a defensive, uh, whatever you call it, the... Uh, you're just gonna uh, use your action to dodge, or? Uh, yeah, I can't. I gotta figure out which weapon to use now because I you don't have a great axe or a maul. Yeah, and I have to. But I, I had other, like I have a glaive from before, so I don't know if that was. I mean, <laughs> sure. a glaive is pretty big, so I don't know how I would hide that. Yeah, I have a mace, but the old they all prison suck. pocket. <laughs> I do a plus two mall. Uh, this is this is the uh, the place where uh, individuals could could actually have large enough prison pockets uh, <laughs> to, to hide glaives. Okay. All right. Um, anyway, yeah, I'll take the dodge action. Just okay. get my shield out, and that's it. The campaign is with an arrow sticking out of it. Oh, sorry, and I'll I'll rage. Okay, at the end You're... of my turn. All right. Uh, is going to tell Rolikos to halt. And I need you. To make a wisdom save, Rollercoaster. Uh, 17? Uh huh. As you, you try to shrug this off, you hear familiar laughing in your head. You just made, you heard a day or two ago uh, to get a unicorn. And uh, I need you to roll that again. Okay. 18. Nice. Okay. You shrug it off. Off class. Stop D and D Beyond doing that. 
I love the Cambion, their fiendish blessing. The AC of the Cambion includes its charisma bonus. How does that work? I don't. <laughs> Let's go with it. And the next one. And the Cambion that just did that to you is going to fly out ahead of you guys about 60 feet <laughs> are they all out ahead of us now <laughs> uh they're pretty close all right and this cambion is going to Uses fiendish charm on you, Rollercoaster. Okay. Make a wisdom save. Thirteen. You hear his words in your head. Uh, say, "Hey, buddy, you remember me, right? I'm your litter mate. All those years ago. <laughs> Let's go talk about what's been going on." And you find yourself charmed. Uh oh. Sick, sick. Just, just wanted to find a river, man. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I do feel bad about you being the only. Uh, <laughs> that shit happens. That's what's. It is what it is. Roz, this is a terrible idea. We shouldn't do it. Everyone else, let's go do it. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. Let's don't also don't let me into there. Let's I also said, uh, you know, I want it to be unanimous. Let's also remember Jake saying, if you guys really want a TPK, I'll give it to you <laughs> in relation to this plan. Which I really feel also like I could right past that. I couldn't have been more clear about. No, no. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, you yeah. were solid. Uh, Lulu is going to do her word. darndest to fly her little holophant butt uh, ahead. And she's, uh, you hear her kind of whimpering and uh, super scared. And at the bottom of the round, uh, two large fiends fly up from uh, the sides of not where the Arcanoloth was on the dock, but kind of uh, down the bank. And then uh, these two fiends, let me get a picture for you. It's, it's a very classical look for a devil. You guys are just feeling your what's it what's those saying? Feeling your oats or that's the saying. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I didn't even want oats. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even <laughs> want oats. <laughs> I mean, look at the bright side. We could have gone with the bean idea, and it could have been much worse. Actually, oh, I'm man. not sure. I was gonna say like you might might as well just throw a bean now. Like can't be any worse. I, I, I I'm unconscious. I can't throw a bean. <laughs> <laughs> uh, two of those horn devils uh, are flying. Cool. Sure. Great. Seem to be Love called it. by the Arcana Loss magic. All right, and Rolikos, um the Cambion, your litter mate now, uh, tells you to go ahead and head back towards the dock. Uh, use all your movement to do that, <laughs> and I'll be right with you. Cool. I guess that's what I do. <laughs> do I get a save again anywhere? 
I'm double checking. I don't think so, but I'm double checking. I feel like no, I haven't don't. gone since he got charmed. Uh, that's true. You haven't gone. Uh, but he got charmed at the bottom of the round, and then his act. His... Oh, and this is his turn. Got gotcha. yeah, his turn. Yeah, all good. Cool. All right. The flying bone devils turn. Was that a no on the saving throw? Correct. Uh, there's certain things that need to yeah. happen. All right. Bone devils are going to fly up to you, Ollie. Jarvis, uh, excuse me, Jerry, you saw you're, you're like in a protective stance and you saw a roller coaster just take off like he does at speed back towards the dock. Uh, very confusing for you. But the Bone Devils um, going to attack Ollie because that's the only person uh, that's the closest person. I will say my feline's agility was not up. So it was okay, 60 so feet. 60 feet. So not as fast as you've seen him go. Still pretty fast. Um, Multi-attack. Wow, terrible rolls. Two claws swing uh, swings of their bone devils claws. One, two claw swings from one of the bone devils uh, goes misses wildly. Uh, and then it's Stinger prepared to dance out of the way is a 24 to hit and as you've seen me do like 40 times I dodge the first two attacks and jump right into the other one. <laughs> <laughs> oh god not again <laughs> piercing damage uh, okay Okay, you get 17, uh, 17 poison damage from the sting, and then 10 piercing damage. Okay. And I need you to make a constitution saving throw. Bad. Nine. You are poisoned. You have the poison condition. Great. Great. And the other bone devil needs to go. Here I thought I was going to be able to run away. Still might. Who knows? Oh, yeah, maybe. I just realized I have advantage on dex save throws, which I did not use on that lightning. Oh, well. All right. Two claws. Uh, another, not as bad, but still pretty bad rolls. An 11 on the first claw attack and a 16 on the second. No, sir. Let's see what the sting does. Right? Claw, claw. 22 to hit. Oh, God. <laughs> Nine piercing damage plus. So but I'm not going to be for long. <laughs> uh, 15 poison damage. And I'm down. Maragon's turns. Damn. One of the Maragons is going to halberd attack Jarvis. At advantage. But at disadvantage. You're dodging, right? Jarvis oh, is Jar- down. I'm unconscious. Not Jerry. Sorry. Not Jerry. I, wrong J name. <laughs> Got him crossed. Um, I already marked you down for dead. <laughs> <laughs> Rude. 
<laughs> I don't know. This is the first time where I've, like I've it feels more real because they're attacking someone who's down. Right. It's like the first time I'm, in this whole game. Right, that I'm not tricking Jake into killing me. <laughs> well, the other times you died, I feel like one he, time he, just because you fell a lot or something. <laughs> no, he didn't realize that I yeah. was going to take so many death saving throws by his attacks. So he killed me. Yeah, I wasn't. Mentally. My shitty uh, <laughs> memory for rules. Yeah. Uh, you fail two death saving throws on the first halberd attack. And uh, you're dead. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, it's. Uh, I mean, this whole plan was my idea. If anything, I deserve to die. So for bad group decisions. <laughs> no, is what I'm it's, sorry for. Yeah. No, I'm good. I'm. I'm. I'm not upset about it. Oh, we're all about to join you, so <laughs> don't worry about it. The other Maragon seeing the life flow out of Jarvis is going to run, pull out its crossbow, and try to hit Jerry. From 120 feet? It ran up, and then it's a heavy crossbow, so it has extra distance. Yeah. But you're using the dodge, so that gives me disadvantage, sir. Oof. 18? Nope. Whew. I was worried. It was a 14 and 18. Uh, all right. All of you making death saves? Sure. Pass. 17. Nice. I'm really sad that I'm going to die without my maul in my hand. That's kind of sad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, the Arcanoloth in front of you is going to get closer and chain lightning again. Uh, Jerry, you need to make a dex saving throw. I am technically pretty close to Jerry. Yeah, you're within 60 feet because you ran the opposite you're way. You're 60 feet away from me. Uh, that's not close enough, roller coaster, to get hit. I was 40 feet away, then I ran 60 feet towards him. So don't 16. He he he! I thought he ran. Oh, he ran next to me, and he was protecting you. Oh, okay. And then you took off the opposite direction gotcha. for sixty feet. I forgot he got close to me. Uh, what'd you get, Jerry? Sixteen. Okay. Uh, that's gonna be uh, ha go ahead and half sixty, so thirty. Uh, lightning damage. And then, uh, Ollie, you're within range. I think. That's tough. Uh, if you're unconscious, you automatically fail. Fail Dex. a death save. Yeah. As for momentarily, you see Ollie's lifeless, life, lifeless body kind of start to move and then it goes back. <laughs> so, sorry, Brian. It's all good. Uh, all good. Jerry. Um, who is it? The the Maragon that's doing the charming. The the flying. Uh, uh, I'm not sure you would know that. Um, What's the one that just charmed? Uh, oh yeah, so the one ahead. Uh, one of the the one with the arrow tried to charm you specifically. Oh, but, but who charmed uh, Rollercoaster though? Because he was the one who was far out ahead of everybody. I'm not sure you would know he was charmed. 
You think you okay, would? Well, me, Dave is asking, cause just from positional standpoint, where that guy is and what, what he's called, what character is it? You want to know the Cambion, where the Cambion is? The one, the one that charmed Rolikos. He's he's the furthest character out, right? No, the Arcana he, he flew... the Jackal okay. Ed. Is. Oh, okay. And that's not the character that charmed Rolikos. Correct. Okay. Yeah, I just want to go to the farthest character, uh, which I don't think is that far, right? So you want to go is... to the to the Jackal Headed one that just shot lightning? <laughs> sure. All right. What are you gonna do? I just want to grapple him. I don't really know what else to do. Okay. Uh, burr, burr, burr. Make a uh, athletics check to grapple. Twenty-five. You got a twenty-five too. So. <laughs> You rolled a nat wow. 20 and wow uh, yeah let me just double check that so oh check that hold on 18 plus yeah incorrect 20, 23 25 23 you got him he's grappled that's yeah, one small victory what the <laughs> wrong stat okay cambion with the arrow in it he is Going to command Jerry to drop. And I need you to make a wisdom saving throw. Mm, not going to do it. Uh, five. You hear the word drop and you feel willed to let go of the Arcanoloth and you don't do anything. You just let go of him. Next Cambion's turn. It's going to... Fire Ray, you, Jerry. A 22 and a 26. Both hit. Uh, nine and 11 fire damage as two fire rays. Uh, okay. Yeah. So I'm my get back up from my. Uh, Relentless endurance, but then I go back down unconscious. Okay. I mean, like I go down, you know what I mean? But I go down yeah, to yeah. zero, but I go up to one. Yeah. And then I go back then, down. Yeah. Uh, all right. So we got one player charmed, two making death saves. One dead. Well, one's one dead. dead. One's dead, dead. Lulu is full on crying. <laughs> How far away is she at this point? She's catching up with uh, to where um, she's on this turn. If she keeps going, uh, she would pass Rollercoaster, I guess. And uh, she's basically it's she's slow, so it's she's not uh, nothing's going to work for her. Um, and bottom of the round, the two Horn Devils that just were called. One of them is going to make a beeline for Lulu. And the other is going to head over to Jerry and Ollie.
and uh, basically make two failed uh, death saving throws for you, Jerry, as it pokes you with its fork weapon. I mean, I guess I should roll for it, but it's such a high fucking... Yeah. So two death saves gone there. For the first one, it has multi-attack too. Yeah, so... uh, Jerry falls lifeless as he gets poked twice with the fork from the Horn Devils. And... Do you mean I'm dead? Yeah. <laughs> uh... I don't know what falls lifeless means when I'm already on the ground. So, uh, yeah, Just l- less of life, I guess. Um... Even more in the ground. Yeah. Rollercoast, you continue to do what you were told. Yep. And the Bone Devils catch up. And take care of Ollie. (laughs) With a 24 and a... Yeah, it's... Well, guys, Rollercoast, I will narrate what happens next. You are charmed by the litter mate, what you believe is a litter mate, and you are taken uh, inside the docks, underneath the docks, because they are raised, and there's uh, a whole situation of structure beneath it, uh, and there's cages you're put in a cage and um for that day you're pretty happy about it uh because you're charmed and uh yeah guys <laughs> yay mtb can have so what happens to rollercoast did he die he's imprisoned uh i don't know if rollercoast wants when what happens know what when- happens to what happens when Rollercoaster's uh, ha- disguise drops? <laughs> they, they stab me, I'm assuming. <laughs> it doesn't really matter because a couple of them have a uh, true, true sight. sight. Oh. When you describe the Arcolas as having a, a monocle, I was like, ah, oh, we're fucked. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Took a little bit longer for me to realize we were fucked. I didn't want my meta knowledge to. <laughs> Guys, interfere here. I, I had a good think, feeling we were fucked going into yeah. it. <laughs> yeah, you did. I, I thought you we had rightfully so, roller coaster. I mean, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Operation River Six, which was a play on Ocean's Eleven, uh, <laughs> did not go so well. Maybe because there were only five of us, we didn't find the sixth person. Oh, it was, it was I, Lulu. I, oh, I, yeah. I, never mind. Exactly. I, I, just, I just counted the screens. We like, needed oh, yeah, the six. sixth person. They and, would have made it perfect. Yeah. And Rollercoast, you don't ever see Lulu again. Yep. Yeah, uh, I assume I'm just dead. Uh, or tortured well, nice. beyond recognition. Lulu's flying Something towards the lines. new characters that we're about to roll. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's really up to you guys. If you guys want to keep playing we can roll new characters I, yeah i would need time to think well, about what we, kind of character i want to do we lost i always the... assumed jerry would be very hard to kill but he's actually pretty Every... easy to kill against 12 people i feel like everything we worked for was to get that letter and now that letter is gone <laughs> uh, that's cut really to, funny cut to uh the letter just like blows. one of the cambians uh <laughs> like is searching your bodies and comes across a letter and Goes, huh? And shows they, it to the Arcana Loth. They actually were going to battle. <laughs> and the Arcana Loth they actually goes, weren't lying. Huh. Uh they you guys didn't, didn't mention to lie. You didn't mention the letter at all. Nope. No. So there Would was that no have helped? I was, I was going by no, I was just going off. You could have you could have gone deception. 
you could have gone the route of, hey, guys, we have a letter introducing us to Bell. Don't shoot us. Please, God, no. It crossed my mind. I knew uh, that you could have gone that, and that would have given you some sort of chance. Um, but either way, the whole idea, as I made clear, it was terrible. And with the amount of defenses the docs have, like a battleship, a, a infernal battleship is docked at. Yeah, we were going to get on it <laughs> and steal it. And like... No, not steal oh, it. So... They were going to take us across willingly. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it was unclear to me the risk we were taking. It's sort of like I, in my mind, it was just going to come down to like one good ollie deception uh, role I, yeah um, oh no i knew it'd be several <laughs> and probably many of us contributing in various ways before the end uh the end came quick and viciously though and now we're all dead it's all good you know me i get to roll a new character now <laughs> you should make bets uh, uh I mean, on what which which number of brian's characters will make it to the end of this campaign <laughs> like do we think it'll be the fifth one or the sixth one <laughs> not a bad idea i'm actually excited myself to roll a new character so okay. yeah I, spoiler alert i might Don't just roll a better version of jerry um nothing says you can't roll up another barbarian go if for we it. need to take an extra week off we can do that if you guys aren't ready I am going to be gone next week regardless. Okay. okay. Let's just take next week off because I have some deadlines I need to do and that would really help me out. Sounds good to me. Cool. Uh, I'm did sorry, we, Roz. Did we uh, stop recording? Hey. No, we're still live. Hey. The <laughs> no, only one that didn't want to do this plan lived longer than the rest. <laughs> so. And possibly never died. Pro possibly in the most humiliating Probably way, wishes though. he was dead. Yeah. Probably. I don't want to go into details about what could happen. Do you ever see a lot of certainly don't have any fur and... anymore? Do you ever see little Nikki? I did a long time ago. What? Oh, okay. I don't remember when, any. Of uh, it. Hitler is getting punished in hell. I don't remember that. Part. Oh, okay. I won't go into details because we're on Twitch. Okay. For Rolikos, I imagine it's a lot of laser pointers and baths and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> uh yeah baths and acid um guys that was rough but um it was shit fun happens. it was fun i've never I've i feel never like if you TPK don't before. at least attempt stuff like that it's not if you just always play it safe it's just like what's the point oh sure I, you guys will I remember feel, you yeah. guys will remember this for the rest of your lives and any D, &D memory you have you'll remember this we got a tpk i've, yeah. I've never been tpk though i did tpk my party as a dm not alone TPK have i never just been means like your entire party dies. total party total kill. party yeah. party no. kill yeah not alone not just like i've never been part of a tpk but i've never had a character die so it's it, it's time <laughs> i've never had a character die either but this is only like my fourth character so well now they've been murdered mm -hmm. mercilessly rip Man. jarvis rip jerry will never get to save his family but maybe yeah. someone else from jerry's family will step up Maybe. <laughs> there you go. I like it. Good job, Jerry. I prepared, like, I forgot uh, this was Monday, and I started preparing, like, an hour before, and uh, all the things that I thought were going to happen didn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> and I think the happened. first thing we had to do in this episode, yeah. like, took the entire session, so... I was fully expecting you guys to take the, since you guys had done it before, take the, uh, the <laughs> ferryman. But <laughs> Jarvis likes risk. <laughs> Ollie likes lying. <laughs> I mean, he's a good liar. Uh, it's just living. Dude, he was overconfident this time. We did this a for. Sword, we sword did... made him overconfident. It was cursed after all. There we, you go. We did this for two soul coins. I just want to throw that out there. Yep. Yes, we did. I feel like. I feel like. <laughs> Rollercoast probably in his heart hearing over the days and weeks some of the ideas that Jarvis has had is probably think this this guy's gonna get me killed. <laughs> After we started putting our own party members to sleep <laughs> when it started. I wanted oh, I wanted man. to I wanted to play a risky character and I did. Yeah, yeah, you did. Um 
over the next two weeks, guys, just let me know what you're thinking. Let me know if you have any issues creating a character in D&D Beyond. I don't imagine you should, but uh, let me know. I can also help you. I've done it. Are we just supposed to make it at the same level? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And uh, we'll say... Uh, we'll figure out. Uh, I'll get back to you on what you have, what things you have. Sounds good. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching this TPK episode of Venture Ventures Baldur's Gate Descent into Avernus or listening. That's how a TPK works, <laughs> and that's how a TPK works when it's telegraphed. Uh, but shit happens. And we had fun, so that's all that matters. And look, people half in, of us are still smiling. People in the chat are also <laughs> upset that uh, <laughs> people in the chat are upset that we didn't talk about what happened to Rollercoaster after the fact. <laughs> well, I would say Rollercoaster would be tortured, and if we're going to make it story uh, tied up nicely for the story that's happened with with this group, I would say that he would run into the large chain devils that he saw in the mansion. Uh, you were in the mansion, right? Yep. Yeah, and uh, they're specifically made to torture, and that's exactly what would have happened. Um, yeah. Well, guys, that's it. I didn't get <laughs> a chance to roleplay Jerry's death. As the final strike hits, Jerry takes out his journal, and he says, I miss my... M-. And he wants to say mall, but you know you can interpret that to mean mom. Sure. I sure. definitely went to mom in my head. You, you <laughs> plucked at my heartstring with that for a second there, Jer, until you finished the thought. Yep. Oh, it's mall. Oh, okay, never mind. Except when you think about all the ter- the terrifying creatures around him that are like poking him with infernal weapons. Uh, yeah. Thanks, guys. Thank Thanks, you, Jake. Be good to yourself. Be good to everyone else. Black Lives Matter. And we'll see you guys in two weeks with new characters. Who Woo! We'll see what decisions they make. Uh, yeah. Only the best. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>